Suppose the sides of a cube are expanding. So the object we're looking at here is a cube, and a cube has square faces, and uh, all of the dimensions are gonna be equal. So if we call one dimension x, the other two are also x. So we have the, suppose that the sides of a cube are expanding at a rate of two inches per minute. So we have two inches per minute, and we wanna get some notation to go with that. What is it that's two inches per minute? Well, we see the inches per minute um, units there and know that it's a rate of change. So this will be something dt. So uh, looking at it uh, in the context of reading this problem, we see that the sides of the cube are what we're talking about and the sides we've denoted with an x. So this would be dx dt. But also if we're looking at the units, we see units being inches per minute. So what's measured in inches? Well, it would be a length measurement. So it would make sense then that we're talking about the length of one of the sides. So we have that dx dt is two inches per minute. Since we have that it's expanding at that rate, we have um, that dx dt is positive. If instead we had that it was shrinking, we'd have to throw in an extra negative sign in front because it would uh, the dx dt would be negative because the sides would be getting smaller. So continuing to read this, the question is how fast is the volume of the cube changing? So we're looking for the related rate dv dt. That's what we want to answer for this question, but we can go ahead and figure out what the units would be. So we have the units that match the, um, the v and the t. The v units would be on top, the time t units would be on the bottom, and time t is being measured in minutes for this particular problem. To get the units for volume V, we'd have to use the units for the side length. Side lengths are being measured in inches, so volume then would be inches cubed. Also, since the sides are expanding, we had that dx dt was positive. The cube's getting bigger, the volume's getting bigger, so we would also expect dv dt to be positive as well. So we are given one extra piece of information. So it says, at the moment, the area of the cube's base. So let's think about the area of the cube's base. The cube's base itself is a square, and it's an x by x square. So we're talking about the area of that x by x squared. That would be x squared. It says at the moment, the area of the cube's base is equal to 10 um, square inches. So we are given uh, the fixed snapshot time there to be whenever x squared is equal to 10. So to be able to do this related rates problem, we need to be able to relate the variable v with the variable x. So that's gonna be the volume equation for this cube. Um, in general, it would be length times width times height, but for the cube, each one of those is equal to x. So we would have x cubed being our um, equation, volume equals x cubed. So we take the derivative with respect to t of both sides. So d dt of v is equal to d dt of x cubed. And so d, uh, dv dt would be what we have on the left-hand side, and the derivative with respect to time of x cubed, we'd have the power rule, but then we'd have to remember the chain rule part since um, x is varying over time. So the power rule says bring the three down and drop the power on x by one, but again, we finish this chain rule by bringing out the derivative of that inside function x. So we have dx dt multiplied there. So when we're looking at trying to figure out what our final answer is, we're looking for a dv dt, we actually know exactly what x squared is because x squared was the area of the cube's base. So we know that to be 10 and we can plug 10 in directly for x squared. And we also know that dx dt is two. So we can get our final answer then by plugging in those values. dv dt is equal to three times, we've got 10 for x squared and we've got two for dx dt. So completing that, we've got dv dt equals 3 times 10 would be 30 times 2 would be 60. And then we already saw that the units were going to be inches cubed per minute. And it was positive like we expected it to be.